My name is Carlos Aramayo. I'm the president of Unite Here Local 26. Uh, we represent over 12,000 members in Massachusetts and Rhode Island in the hospitality industry. Uh, we're here today. Uh, we were going to have a much bigger crowd. Um, and we have over a hundred people who have joined us by Zoom. There's a Zoom video that's being made. Um, we decided this morning, uh, given what Governor Raimundo has been saying about the continued spread of COVID-19, to scale back this event uh, to allow for social distancing. We were nervous about having uh, over 140 people, 150 people here. And so the leaders of our union here in Providence have come to participate, uh, but they are not alone. I want to make sure everyone knows that we have hundreds of people on Zoom. Hello, there we go, on Zoom right there. We have hundreds of people on Zoom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because there are hundreds of people who work in the hospitality industry who are deeply affected by the pandemic and by the economic consequences of the pandemic. When Governor Raimundo uh, and the political leadership of this state took the very wise decision to shut things down, a decision that we have supported in March, our members and the workers in the hospitality industry were the first people to suffer the economic consequences of this pandemic. They were the first people to lose their jobs and to be placed on layoff. And many, many of those workers remain on layoff today with very little prospect of returning to work anytime soon. Uh, we have a hotel here, uh, the Biltmore, the Graduate, that remains closed. We have the Omni that remains closed. And we have many other hotels here in the city that are open but have very little business due to the pandemic. And we continue to support the measures that the governor and the state and the city have taken during this pandemic to keep people safe. But we want a guarantee. That's why we're here today. We want to guarantee that when, when the economy returns, when people begin to travel again, when events start to fill, when events start to fill the banquet halls of our hotels and of the convention center, that the workers, the workers who've spent decades making these the best hotels and the best event sleuth centers in the state of Rhode Island, that they get the opportunity to get their job back. to come back to their jobs and frankly that hotel companies should not be able to cynically use the pandemic to cut people's wages and to hire new people off the street before all of my brothers and sisters here get their opportunity to return to work. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we stand in support of the City Council who just introduced and moved forward an ordinance that says that these people here will have the opportunity, the first chance when their job is recreated, when those events are happening again and those rooms are filled, that they will be asked to return to work in order of seniority. Yeah, 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 yeah. We are happy that, that the City Council of Providence is standing with us today and will continue to stand with us. Yeah.